Alrighty, let's watch this in full as always and go. He checks. Ooh. Oh, nice. That's a good take. Yes. Cool, cool. Looks around. All right. Cool. Let me just check the ending here. This is ever so slightly fast. Shoot, right there, that exit. Just I'm we're also reacting to all of this, like stuff like that feels fairly realistic, almost referency. And then that suddenly gets more cartoony snappy. Um not snappy, but just it's just very zippy with that exit. And the reason why I mentioned this is because it's it's a bit of a style break. That's that's all I would say here for the for the end. Just that, just in the, you know, it's like three four frames, slowing it down. If it's a bit more in line with what's going on through there. Even that feels fairly uh, more on the realistic side. I do like this a lot. I like the look, and then the checks, and then <gasps> has that big fan of that. That's cool. Even like the little foot up for tension there. You might say I'm picky and that creates a little bit of a tangent there and you can free up that foot a bit in terms of silhouette. The only thing I would say, <laughs> I know you're going to listen to going, oh my God, really, really, subjectively. I think I would just watch out for those last couple frames there. I'm a big fan of this. The thing for me subjectively is that because he's casual, looks and goes, oh, now you expect he saw someone let's react let's react and it's more let me just go down and then jump it's just this section i would give this more urgency and less of a oh let's wait just it's it's almost like a direct he's taken and whoa down and immediately into a jump and not taking that much time I think that's all I would say. Because you get that slow and then suddenly that very fast feel again. And I think if you can break bridge that where you start to speed up into this and then into that, it will be a bit more seamless. I think that's pretty good. You might someone commented on that last time and then And I think just for that height, I think you could afford to go a bit lower. Maybe the butt will be here. Just a bit for compression to then come up. And even because of that, a slight um, bam drag. Maybe the drag, but boom, compression overlap on that head to come back up here. And then watch out your hair drag. This is super picky, but you'll land at this point I would bring that already down down and lower it feels like you're in that in that stretchy part a bit too long that's pretty much it I think that's all cool you know like once you go frame by frame like is it really like I'm looking at that foot going from here and it's the same path, right? Straight. And then it pops suddenly out and it's kind of in the same area there going back. But then when you play this in real time, it's kind of, it's fine. <laughs> you know, so I'm going to say my biggest thing is just that little, a bit fast there. And even then the first note to me subjectively would be just bridging this, giving this more urgency because you are indicating oh, an urge like a reaction oh that is uh you would think that would have more of a repercussion if that someone looking going oh, then you wouldn't go all right well let me go and jump like that feels just a bit out of place so all i would do is just make this faster it might just even be just this whole thing or to me probably cutting out some frames on that hole there anticipation just to go from down and jump just that making that a bit faster Anyway, other than that, it's very cool. It's always been very cool. These little picky things. You've been super patient in uh, addressing these notes. Um, 
and making it so much better and uh it's great so that's all i have totally up to you what do you want to do with it um i'll trust you and uh that's it thank you all right there's an email you can sign up you can start whenever you want you can submit whatever you want you get 16 submissions either way a like and subscribe would be awesome all right thank you